All right, here we are with the burns. Again, it's a little rusty in the bottom as they are. Uh, I got all the pine needles and dirt. It was literally dirt and dust. It was so much. This fan sat in the same place for years and years and years in an old barn. It was an estate sale and the barn was as big as the house. It had all these different sections. Someone had been living in it. There was like a living room and a kitchen. It was very interesting. Uh, an old family home. Uh, you don't see that anymore. Uh, and by the time I got there, everything was all picked over. And this was really what I was here for. This was in the pictures. Um, so we got a two-speed switch, and we'll go ahead and hit it up to high. Quite a startup sound on that one. rattle which is nice Like it. We'll go to walk for a spin down. Obviously not oiled or anything like that, just uh, dust it out and run. Um, so uh, it didn't throw that much dirt around. That was really what I was worried mostly. It was about throwing barn dust all over the house here. So there you go. Not too bad for a fan that has sat unused for 30 years probably. I mean really. You should have seen this place. So, there you go. There's your Burns Air King. Uh, it's nice that the handle is not broken, although it's pretty yellow. Um, that switch knob is there. So, uh, yeah, pretty cool. And like I was saying in the other video, I really like these this blade hub here. Um, so, thanks for watching. There's the Burns Air King over. Once we get into the good weather season, uh, we'll pull the blades, pull the motor apart, and make sure everything's cool with it. Uh, it's got the, the bag on the... This is the wiring, so no one ever messed with this, I don't think. Um, cool startup sound. So there you go, Burns Air King. Early, early 60s, I suppose, you know. Um, the one that's on the stand, that's the one from the 50s. That's a very old, that's older than this. So this is closer to the other one that I have. Uh, the motor just says Burns Air King on it. Uh, who knows if they made it or if it's an early Lakewood or uh, McMillan, rather. I don't really know. Uh, it doesn't matter to me. Uh, but that's all it says on it. It does actually, the motor is interesting. It has, it also talks about, I'll show it someday. Uh, it talks about where the, what the wires are, red, blue, whatever. So, so you can see that not a lot of fan motors have that on there. Uh, and there you go. So there's the Burns Air King. Hope you enjoyed watching the video and we'll see you when the weather gets nicer.